Let's tell them the truth about burpees. Let's get rid of them. Ooh. This ain't the 1800s. We got color TVs. 61. 62. 63. You won't believe what happened in my forearm while training burpees. Look at that. Look, so when you're looking for a juicy apple, see all those freckles and blumps on it? That's what you want to get. Ooh, that's good. Look at that good. That. Look at that good wax. That's that good wax right there. Yeah. That wax won't plug you up. <laughs> so I'm just gonna get four of these juicy apples. These are real juicy too. Yo, yo, what's going on guys? Late night, just got done at the dealership. But hey, I'm getting my burpees in today. I'm waiting for you, Mr. Young Slump to pull up. I'm gonna get my burpees in. We gonna get it going tonight, a hundred of them. Um, I did some shoulders earlier, a few minutes ago at the gym. But yeah, I came back out here to get my camera because I was like, you know what? I might as well do a burpee vlog, guys. So hey, we gotta, we gotta keep pushing forward. Today is day number 45 of burpees. I know the last time I put any burpees on my YouTube channel is when, I'm been, when I was starting the burpee challenge. But guys, I mean, I'm busy. I'm busier than you guys ever know. I mean, I'm selling cars left and right. We making money every day. It's insane. Uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna show y'all guys. Hey, if you stay consistent with something you can just become invincible I mean my body right now feels like I could run 10 20 miles without stopping I mean burpees give you that much endurance if not more so all y'all that are um, uh, Scared or all of you that are doubtful about burpees don't be doubtful it works guys It works. So we went for young slump to pull up in his uh, Ford Expedition um his ford expedition because we got to get him a new car soon we got to get that boy a new car he, i told him and i we got to get you he's in a v8 but you got to get in um a sports car so if you're in the tribe hey much love if you're not in the tribe yet you better join right now if you want to escape the matrix and change your life because my life is changing by the second by the second look let me show you guys what i mean look it's 650 right here right by 651, boom, I'm going to have my life change a little bit more. I'm going to be having my uh, views up a little bit more, be making a little bit more money. That's the cool thing when you work work for yourself, you know, you can make money 24-7 even while you sleep. So, yeah, we getting it in. Where is this boy at? That boy said he going to pull up about 20 minutes ago. This boy ain't nowhere to be found. Me, I ain't creeping in no doubt. Ooh, what they doing? They try to pull up on me? Oh, no, they's going inside. But yeah, guys, we getting it in. We getting it. We doing it. I'm doing it. See, I'm about to get these burpees in, guys. And to me, burpees are way better than, you know, right back behind here is the track. Way better than running on the track or walking. I mean, still do that. That's great cardio. You want, when you're young, guys, you just want your endurance to be through the roof. That's just, it is what it is. You got to, because if you start now when you're young, by the time you get old, guys, guess what? This is your, your body's gonna be the same. Your body's gonna be healthy. Your body's gonna be strong. So hey guys, I hope this find. I hope you find this motivating. Hey, today I'm gonna show you guys how to do a hundred burpees flawlessly. And I'm gonna have my cameraman count because a lot of y'all been saying, "Oh, you ain't doing a hundred burpees. You doing just ten? Uh, are you just doing about eighty and fast forwarding it?" Now nah, we doing a hundred, and I'm gonna prove it to you guys. So as soon as he pulls up, we gonna get up in this gym. But is that him? Uh, yeah, that might be him down there. As soon as we get uh, get up in that gym, we're going to show you 100 burpees. I've been doing every day. I do 10 sets of 10 on my burpees. They think I just, because I what I do is I fast forward it, mm -hmm. you know, and they think I only do four or five sets. So hold on, I'm going to get I'm you. living verification. This man did do. Yeah, I'm going to get in the tribe real quick. This is... If you're an exclusive member, you all have access to that, guys. The Money Tribe. So I'm gonna go live in it so I can show these guys how me and my producer. How my producer and I. How me and, wait, how what? My producer and I. My producer and I shoot content. So so yeah, just tell me, tell me when to go. We'll get these 100 burpees in. All right, go ahead, man. 
stop. They want me to do them like big boy, where they hit their stomach. You see how they do it? Yeah. I like the, the old school people in prison. Yeah. They call them uh, sidewalk huggers. They do this. This one ain't gonna count as a hundred. They go. <clears throat> like that, they don't even jump. You gotta jump. They activate them hamstrings and calves. Set number three. Let's get it. Twenty-three. I was like, what? What's the number? Twenty-five. Twenty-six. Twenty-seven. Twenty-eight. Twenty-nine. 30. Woo! Y'all don't know what I'm imagining. When I'm going down, I imagine I'm jumping. So you got burpees build up your stamina. Not just in the gym, in the bedroom, everything. The good, better your stamina is, the better you can do things in life, in all seriousness. We gotta keep this PG so they don't try to hit us with anything. Keep you off the internet. Yeah. Oh, he's telling the truth about burpees. Let's get rid of them. Ooh. That's what they gonna say. All right, set number four. All right. And then after this, it's all downhill. All downhill after that. 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. 37, 38, 39, 40, yes sir. One more round, it's halfway. It's all downhill after that. I can do this in my work clothes. It's these tight uh, pants on. Y'all could do them in some gym clothes. Or, get in your drawers, and do it beside your bed at night. That's how I started off. Your drawers is crazy. Well, you don't want to be naked doing them. Yeah. I mean, you're gonna get carpet burned if you do. Most of you have carpet at your house. All right. So number five. 41. 42. 43. 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. Halfway there. 
halfway there. It's all down here. Look at this brow. Ooh. I'm always sweating. I'm sure a little skin. Sure a little skin is Just a little cool. bit. Uh, you're on starting number six. All right, let's get it. All right. 51. 52. 53 54 55 56 Starting to slow down 58 59 and 60 Oh. Only four more sets, man. Look at look at the look at the sweat on the brow there. You can see it, man. High definition. Coming at you live and in color. Live and in color. Yeah. This ain't the 1800s. We got color TVs. Like like my coworker today said, we got this guy that picks up our cars. And yeah, we also all got to share the same water fountain now. Well, <laughs> we got this guy at work that picks up our cars. And he's you know a member. We seen a Confederate in his car, and my my coworker Victor said, "Victor, are you racist?" He said, "He said no. I, I just put four black tires on my car." <laughs> <laughs> and I asked him again. I was like, "Are you sure, Victor?" He said, "And I'm getting a color TV next week." A color TV next week. Is yeah. Crazy. So and Darren got mad when we were driving. He started turning red. Like <laughs> we're like, "Yep, yeah, we can see it in your eyes." You can see it in your eyes. Alright, what am I at? Seven? Yeah, you're starting set seven. I need to stop talking, my mouth is getting dry. 61. 62. 63. 64. 65. 66. 67. 68. 69 70 Three more sets. Three more. Three more. That's it. I mean info. I gotta get a thumbnail. I'll, I'll figure out one. Thumbnails are crucial, Facebook. Thumbnails are crucial. Would y'all all of y'all that are in the money and muscle tribe, y'all know that. Your thumbnail. This is what's your port. Back on these last three sets, guys. Ooh. Come on, man, you got it. Just three more. Three more sets. Man, ain't nothing but 30. 10, 10, 10. Anyone can do 30 reps. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and that's eighty. Twenty more reps. Two more sets. Something slight. You can go home and say it quick. I give up, like I gotta roll up my sleeves like, uh, what's his name used to do? Remember Triple H? Yeah. When he would be dressed up and he's about to get into a fight with somebody? Yeah. He would, he'd say, okay. He'd roll up his sleeves. Go ahead and start. And he'd roll up his sleeves. And he'd get to uh, fight. All right, 20 more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They call these long bombs. <laughs> Because they're slow. Eight. That's what they're calling. Nine. The other ones I was doing earlier were 
two pumps. One more. And then you only got 10 left. 90. 10 more. 10 more. I'm just covered in sweat. I'll pick that up. Hey, you got it. After this, we gotta see you do 10. Do 10? Yeah, you I can do, do 10. You can pull off 10. I can do so 10. So what you do, is you'll do 10 every day. Before work, and then before you know it, you'll do 20. Cause I started off with 50. I was just do 50 a day. Yeah, look at that. That's from that blood flow, that endurance, guys. Look, this could be, hey Facebook, this could be the thumbnail right here for today's video. Hold on, make sure you get a good one. Cause I can freeze frame it on the Sony. I mean, all the veins up in there. That's as much as I can squeeze, man. You won't believe what happened to my forearm while training burpees. Look at that. That'll be the 30 second intro. All right, last set. All right, one. Two, three, four, five, six, come on man, four more, seven, three more man, come on, eight, I did last year like big boy. Nine. And that's one hundred burpees done. Uh -huh. A hundred burpees done, guys. Let's see young slump do them. There you go. There you go. Now you gotta go all the way down with it. There you go. Ooh, he about to be sweating. There you go, you looking good. You do a hundred of these a day, you'll be shredded in no time. There it is. Yeah. There you go, one more. I lost count. Yeah, you just got one more. Ooh, -wee. you got them burpees in them, guys. Yes, sir. Let's go to stuff. I'm gonna get all of them. Look, so when you're looking for a juicy apple, see all those freckles and blumps on it? That's what you want to get. Ooh, that's good. Look, at that good, that. look at that good wax. That's that good wax right there. Yeah. That wax won't clog you up. <laughs> so I'm just going to get four of these juicy apples. These are real juicy too. Look at that. You hear that? ASMR. Yeah, another crisper in the sound of Four apples, two bags of seedless grapes because they don't have seed. It. And I know y'all in the tribe are mad at me. No one put it down. But you know, Mr. Kev Ramon says fruit is fruit. He don't care if it's seeded or not. Real solid. I don't know though. I never tried no honey melon. I'm gonna get one though. Hey, five dollars. That's where the golden honey is. Oh, for these. Ooh, these so weird. These don't even have no price. They must be expensive, so I'm gonna get one. <laughs> I don't even know when honeydew season is. Oh look, they got these watermelons here, but don't trust these. These are some uh, lemons. Literally, they bad. Fruit's good though. Fruit's good for you guys. These, those melons right there, real bad. Oh look, have you ever tried these, man? Plantains. Plantains are just. Basically, what you call it? Plain bananas? Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're a banana family. Oh. But they're they're 99.9% .9 of the time they're cooked. Oh, okay. You make them in like pies and stuff? Or like. No. You can make them in chips, right? Yeah. Put them in like Toast coconut oil. oil. Okay. Um, you double fry them. Oh, okay. What you do is you get them to a golden brown. You, you, you're going to cut them in about inch thick slices. Mm -hmm and cut them, cook them in a, um, just a light fry. Okay. And then what you do is you cool them down just a little bit and take the bottom of a coffee cup or something like that and flatten them out into the chip. Then you refry them. Okay. 
And you put little sea salt on. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna have to try that. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. other way that I have heard is you take it and split the skin mm -hmm. and cut them in half lengthwise. Okay. Cross hatch them. Put some coconut oil, coconut oil on there, mm -hmm. and either nutmeg, cinnamon, sugar, okay, uh, allspice, mm -hmm. something like that, and bake them okay. until they're soft. Nice. It'd be like a banana treat. That's why it's a treat for baking. Yeah, I've seen that on there. Well, thank you, ma'am. I'll, yeah. I'll sure give that a try.